This is Doug Varnberg and welcome back to another set of tips and tricks. And today we're out on here on Lake DV. It's a little mysterious lake that I like. Uh, some of y'all may have seen it on the Humminbird Simulator, but it's got some really cool stuff. And today, one of the things this lake doesn't have is any contour mapping. It's a little small conservation lake and it does not have any mapping. And what I'm going to do today is I'm going to map it. I'm going to use my Humminbird Onyx, but instead of using Auto Chart Live, I'm going to show what all Humminbird users, users that are Lake Master compatible can use is a product called Auto Chart. It is a program, it's a PC based program. You got Auto Chart and Auto Chart Pro. The Auto Chart Pro allows you to look at some other things like bottom hardness and SI mosaics, but uh, what you got to do is you got to use your sonar recordings. Uh, if you go to your home screen here, you'll come down here to recordings and all you have to do is record sonar which is the top button here you would have a little different menu on your the core products the 800 900 1100 series but uh, we're going to come down here we're going to do recording sources we're actually going to record with the onyx we can select what we're going to look at we're going to do 2d and we're going to do the side imaging is our two things so we can use that auto chart auto chart pro the version that I have so I can see my side imaging mosaics and I can also look at uh, bottom hardnesses out here uh, there's some rock piles there's mud it's, it's a really cool little lake but all you got to do is hit start recording and you'll see the record button toweling up fire up and let's start building lakes I'm going to uh, not give you all the detailed uh, sonar footage because it's going to be a pretty boring day out here. It's a no wake lake, so I've got to idle around. But uh, I'm just going to uh, record the data and then I'll show you the processes, the processes to okay, create we'll come your own back home with our data uh, from scanning today. Uh, got got the laptop here. You'll need to get the auto chart or auto chart pro I have the pro version here uh, when you get it you will get some goodies one being a CD uh, quick setup guide and you will get a zero line card the zero line card will allow you to import export you can save your sonar recordings to this uh, I used a blank SD card but you can use either way uh, but the mapping data must be saved to the auto chart zero line card. If you're an Onyx user, user you can also use this for auto chart live data to share. Uh, I've already got the CD installed. We can look right down here. I have the auto chart icon. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here and click on it. We're going to insert our auto chart data okay we've got our mapping cards with our data we've actually got two different cards because we ran over the limit of one of our cards had some other stuff on there at this screen you will see the import screen when you need to go to import and you'll need to go to your find your removable discs in your SD card reader and you'll come down here to the DAT file double click on it and it'll convert it and you'll see your data boxes pop up and you will see your outline now if you insert your zero line card in a card reader it'll change from the world map to the actual zero line of this lake it'll automatically recognize it so you can see we've got it there you come up here right up here to the top put your mouse over it'll say create map we click on that and it has just created a map for us with all of our contour lines uh, we can zoom in and all we have to do to export the map is go to 
Lake Master update. Update your Lake Master SD card with new chart data. We're going to select the depth and feet. And it is adding the data to our new and we will have a custom map. Once we get this done, I'll show you some of the cool things that this can do. Your Lake Master SD card has been updated with your new chart. Would you like to change the background map display of the custom to the custom Lake Master map? Okay. Now here's our new Lake Master map. We're going to zoom in. Look at the data details. There's points. Look at the points up here in the little humps. But now the cool thing is like this is the 3D view. Look at the 3D. You can turn it. You can push up and you can see all around. Isn't that cool? Now there's some other settings. If you come over here to oh, that's Waypoint Manager. We don't want to do that one. But settings, we got it on palette three. You can change to your color palettes that you're normal used to. Now one other thing is the depth range. Since this is a pretty shallow lake, we're going to move max We're going to change our depth range. Since it's about 30 foot, whoop. Go to 35 foot. There's our deep water, our shallow water. Lake Master has filled in those extra areas to the zero line to make sure it's 100% covered. We didn't get it all done yet. And we could use some We'll go back out. But there's our Lake Master mapping data. Now, isn't that cool? Now you can do bottom hardness. You can see the harder the harder spots. You can also do side imaging mosaics. There's settings in here. Uh, you can set gain and you can set types of color palettes so you know where the hard bottom spots, soft bottom spots are. This is a really cool program, and I'll be showing you a lot more with it. But uh, check it out. Get your AutoChart Pro. How quick was that to make your own custom map? You don't have to worry about anybody else giving the data to them. Your total control of the data. If you want to give it away, you can. Look at those contours. Shows you a lot more what's out there. Look at this nice little ridge and stuff that's here. There's a lot of neat things. These sharp breaks along the old dam wall there. The river channel. This map had zero contours and now I'll be able to come back and fish it with contours uh, without uh, but the 3D thing that amazes me that is just amazing look at the different you can look at it differently you got lake master style data of any lake any fishery you can go out here and just do your favorite little spot this is kind of like what auto chart live does to the uh, for the onyx owners but this is just for you you can do a you can show the bottom hardness. Uh, we can turn the 3D on and off. 
you can change the scale uh, this program is amazing what it can do for you but the most amazing thing is there isn't a body of water that cannot be uncharted now you can go out and make your own personal custom map that you don't have to give away to anybody else and it's just for you check out auto chart from Humminbird auto chart pro uh, they're two awesome tools for anybody that is a Humminbird Lake Master or head units like the 700, 800, 900, 1100 series owners here's custom mapping for you check it out hope this uh, set of tips and tricks helped you learn a little bit about AutoChart and AutoChart Pro tune in next time as we go more in depth